What's up, my name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In today's quick video, I'm going to show you how you can cancel your Discord Nitro subscription. Why exactly would you want to do that? Well, currently Epic Games is working with Discord to give away three months of Discord Nitro. If you haven't already claimed it, and if you're watching this video before the 24th of June 2021, you still have time to grab it. Check the description down below for a video explaining exactly what you need to do. This one right over here. Anyways, now that you have the subscription, you had to enter a credit card to be able to actually try the trial. But when the trial ends, you'll automatically be charged for another month, meaning that you've now signed up for Discord Nitro. Don't worry, you're able to cancel Discord Nitro at any time throughout the trial, and you won't be charged when the new month rolls around when your Discord Nitro does finally expire. So how exactly do we do that? Well, first of all, I'll show you on the computer, and then I'll show you on the mobile version, and I'll also show you what happens to server boosts, etc, etc, when you do cancel your Discord Nitro. So, I'll go ahead and open up my Discord client on my computer, and at the bottom left, I'll head across to my user settings. Upon doing this, all you have to do is head across to the subscriptions tab on the left-hand side. As you can see, I've been a subscriber since 11th of June 2021 on this account. When I head across to the subscriptions tab over here, you'll see some information about my account. All we have to do to cancel this is click the cancel button up here. Discord Nitro, blah blah blah, there's a switch plans button and a cancel button right next to it. This is the button that you need to click. However, before I go ahead and click this and show you what happens when you do click it, especially during this three month trial, I'll show you how to get here on your mobile. Simply fire up Discord on your phone and click the hamburger button in the top left. Then what we're gonna do is look for our profile icon in the bottom right, we'll tap on that. Then when you get to this page over here, simply scroll down and you should eventually see manage subscription. Upon clicking this, you'll see this page over here. All that you have to do is click cancel next to switch plans. This one isn't grayed out like it is on my desktop as this is my main Discord account, the one that I actually pay for Nitro on. So what exactly happens to our server boosts when we go ahead and cancel our subscription? Well, of course, I'm able to use animated emojis and everything else that a normal Nitro account can use. But what happens to server boosts when we do cancel our subscription? Well, as you can see on the right hand side, as soon as I find myself, I have the little server boosting icon next to me since 11th of June 2021. Let's go ahead and click the settings button, head across to subscriptions, and now I'll cancel my three month trial over here. As you can see, cancellation will take effect at the end of your current billing period. On the 11th of September 2021, you'll lose access to Nitro, your Discord tag will be randomized if you changed it, and your included server boosts will be removed. You can restart the subscription at any time. Upon clicking next, we get another prompt, and I'll click yes. As you can see over here, any eligible subscription credit will be applied until it runs out. Your subscription will renew for $0 per month on 11th of September 2021. If I click show subscription details, you'll find more info over here. Though this is only really for accounts that are paying for Discord Nitro. So I'll click yup, cancel Nitro. And now as you can see, I have the option to resubscribe. I'm no longer a Nitro user. However, I still am. I'm still able to use animated emojis, such as if I head across this channel over here. If I click this button, you can see animated emojis that I can click on and send to the channel. This account over here is still sending them and I still have Nitro until the end of my billing cycle, which is September the 11th. That's when my three month trial ends. Also something you'll notice is that my account still has a little server boosting icon next to it. Let's go ahead and restart the client to make sure nothing is being cached and left over. I'll quit it from my start bar and I'll open up Discord once again. Heading back to the server, scrolling down on the side, you can see that I'm still server boosting. Now this should last until the end of the three month trial. I don't think there's any limitations, but now I've successfully canceled it. So in three months, I won't be charged anything. And of course I still have my boosts. I still have my ability to do everything a Nitro user can use. And my trial will continue until it eventually finishes, obviously. But anyways, hopefully that answered the most asked questions about the three month Epic Games trial. Once again, if you don't know anything about it, check the description down below. And if you're someone who's capitalizing on this and you have many Epic Games accounts, you may be interested in an Epic Games account switcher. Linked also in the description down below is my Techno account switcher. It's a free open source piece of software that lets you switch between accounts really quickly on Steam, Epic Games, Origin, Uplay, etc, etc. There's a ton of platforms here, completely open source, you're able to go and add to it, and of course if you don't trust it, you're able to build it yourself. Firing up my account switcher, heading into the Epic Games tab, you can see two accounts over here that I can switch between super quickly. But anyways, that's about it for this video. 
Thank you for watching. My name is Mintech Nobby here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.